Coach Olsen na nga ba ang magdadala sa Tam Rouse muli sa Promised Land? Mga ko sa bating ngayon ang Athletics Director ng FEU na si Mark Molina. Mark, good evening and welcome to The Score. Good evening, uh, PJ. Alright, well, uh, take us through the process, Mark. No, alam natin na hindi madali na mag-move on from a loss uh, in the finals. More so, uh, mm -hmm. you're also losing your head coach who who brought you to a championship last year and kumbaga really brought back this program to prominence and into being a, a yearly title contender. So, kumusta yung proseso yun na pinagdaan na ng team at ng community right after that loss and knowing that Coach Nash was leaving them behind? Well, we, we always wanted na to have continuity sa program namin. No? Uh, hmm. That's why one of the reasons that we got all of them, in fact, we didn't really look uh, elsewhere. We looked from within. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden became uh, parang an uh, obvious candidate because uh, of course the uh, competition ni, ni Coach Nash. Mm. Uh, because more, more more than the more than the championship and the basketball aspect, we we feel the biggest contribution ni Nash sa FPU talaga. Like, palagi niya siya sa atin, let's ch change the culture of FPU. Right. Let's play the right way. I mean, on and off the court, let's be respectful of the game. Mm -hmm. I mean, these are the, to me, these are the immeasurable contributions of Nash. Mm -hmm. And I think Olsen is the perfect guy to, to mentor these kids. In fact, when we, the first time I spoke to Olsen about this, yun talaga ang una niya sinabi that uh, I, my passion really is to be a teacher and a mentor for the student athletes. Mm -hmm. Because he, he himself was a really successful student athlete when he right. was in, in Ateneo. So, mm -hmm. we feel he's the right guy mm -hmm. to be able to continue that. Yung, I mean, I'm, I'm sure the basketball will be a little different. I don't think uh, parehong pareho naman ang style ni Jose of ni Nash. There will be changes for sure. Mm -hmm. But uh, what we want is the continuity of uh, the way we've been playing the past few years uh, on and off the court. Wala nang no incidents. Uh, mm -hmm. Our players are very uh, gentlemanly and all and uh, we, 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 we playing, playing the proper way. Yan ang feeling namin na uh, Olsen will be able to continue and that's the priority for the program right now. What what are the things na medyo iba na madadala ni Coach Olsen? Alam natin na uh, coaching wise must experience si Coach Nash coaching us way back with the NBA days uh, mm -hmm. sa Batangas but playing wise uh, playing with great teams with championship teams and winning championships and even in the national team dun naman lamang si Coach Olsen. Anong anong sa tingin mong yeah. mahuhugot niya from that experience? Well, he, he spoke about uh, a few things, no? One is, even when he was coaching the RT youth team, uh, he, they basically ran the same offense as Nash. Eh? Okay. The dribble drive offense. Mm -hmm. So, he spoke of continuing that. Mm -hmm. Now, as far as changing is concerned, he, he wants to, you know, defensive mentality. He wants to pattern it a bit like uh, what Simpson does. Okay. Or, or with, uh, with the never and did before. With, with, with these Alaska teams, with, mm -hmm. the, with the success of Pinto. So, as far as the philosophy is concerned, yan ang gustong ipasok ni Olsen. He's playing, definitely, yung playing uh, career niya will be a factor as well. I, mm -hmm. I, I guess, he will, I, I'm pretty sure he will get instant respect from everybody in our program, not just because he is at Asela, but because of his uh, accomplishments as well as a player. So, uh, I think it will, come, it will help him uh, a long way. Mm -hmm. Well, Mark, we all know that aside from the X's and O's and the system, malaking bagay yung uh, you know, character, yung attitude ng isang coach, uh, personality all the more as well. And, and we saw that work well with Coach Nash kung kasan naging bagay talaga yung personality niya in raising the players uh, from FEU and raising the, the level of basketball and the attitude of the team. Ano naman yung sigurong naiba na personality ni Coach Olsen? We know Coach Nash well now throughout the years, but yeah. um, how well do we know Coach Olsen in terms of his personality and what he can bring to add to the personality of this team and how he can make an impact on these young players? Well, Olsen was also my teammate in, in college. Okay. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm quite familiar with Olsen as well. Mm -hmm. I think they're very, very similar. Their value system is very is similar as well. Mm -hmm. As I, I mentioned, the culture that Nash brought to FU. Yeah. I think El Olsen will will bring that. Uh, I mean, will bring the same thing. Maybe the biggest difference would be maybe a bit in their style. Mm -hmm. I think Nash is a calmer a calmer presence. Mm -hmm. Siguro si Olsen mas ma, mas madalas magagalit sa players than, uh, 
than that. So I, 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 I mean, he's, he's a more, uh, what they call this, uh, fiery type uh-huh. of, uh, of a guy. And that's okay. kasi, talagang whatever happens, talagang cool na cool. So, with, uh, right. uh, Nash, eh. uh-huh. so uh, there'll be changes there. But uh, in, I think generally, in terms of attitude, in terms of uh, the environment of the team, I, I, I expect it to be the same. All right. Now, just to clear things up, does the coaching staff remain? Everybody from the assistants down uh, will still be there for Coach Olsen to just jump in? That is the intention. Okay. Uh, all of our assistants, the, the contacts of our assistants are all, are all expiring mm-hmm. at the end of the year. Okay. So, Olsen also has uh, expressed uh, intention to retain them. We, we would like to keep all of them. So we will start talking to them uh, within the next uh, couple of weeks. All right. And uh, aside from Raymar and uh, who are the other guys that are you losing? Who's coming back uh, to to build this core for for Coach Olsen and the rest of FEU? Everyone. Everyone will return except for Raymar and Monbert. Just Raymar and, and Monbert. Then, okay. And then we expect uh, some of our indie players. Uh, we have a few newcomers who we believe we can instantly help the team as well. Right. Uh, you have some marquee names. We know that uh, serve residency. Uh, paalala lang, Coach Mark. Sino nga ba yung mga yun? <laughs> <laughs> ano kami? I don't know not. You know them naman eh. With FU, we don't deal with personalities. Okay. But paganda, we talk about the team more than the than the players who are coming all right, up. All right. Understood, understood. And you've had great success <laughs> doing that as well. So, Coach Mark, uh, best of luck. Congratulations on, uh, on uh, I guess, Smooth transition and moving on, and uh, we can't wait to see FEU back on the court with another Coach Rasela. So, salamat, Mark, and Merry Christmas! Hi, guys, keep watching the score for the latest sports updates, and don't forget to subscribe to the ABS-CBN Sports in Action YouTube channel.